question 11 it says here is the plan of martin's driveway and we have this rectangular object here and um, which is 11 by 4 it says he's going to cover his driveway with gravel the gravel is six centimeters deep that's probably important uh gravel is sold in bags there are 0 0.4 meters cubed of gravel in each bag and each bag costs 38 pounds Martin gets a discount of 30% off the cost of the gravel. Work out how much he's going to pay. Okay, right back up to the top here. It says it's a plan. So it, what it's telling you is, if you were looking, if you were a bird flying over his driveway, this is what you would see. You only just see the top of it. You don't see how deep it is. But it actually tells us here that it's six centimeters deep. So the first thing we're going to have to do is actually calculate the volume of the driveway in order to work out how many bags he's going to require. So the volume, the volume is going to be found by doing 11 times by four times by, now be incredibly careful here, this is in meters, this is in meters, the depth we're going to have to consider in meters as well, which is going to be 0 0.06 of a meter. So working that out, 11 times 4 times 0 0.06, um, let's see, uh, 4 times 6 would be 24, that's going to be 0 0.24, and 24 times 11 is going to be 264, so it must be um, 2.64 meters cubed. Now you can do that with a calculator. I've uh, used a few little tricks to get that sorted. Okay, so that's the volume of the drive. Now, in order to work out how many bags, I'm going to have to see how many times I can fit 0 0.4 into 264. So the number of bags, the number of bags is going to be found by doing 2.64 divided by 0 0.4. I'm actually going to move this a little bit just so that it fits in nicely. Uh, let's just move that to here. So 2.64 divided by 0 0.4. Now I think in this case I will use the calculator. So 2.64 divided by 0 0.4. We get 6.6 so 6.6 bags now think about this carefully we can't actually buy 0.6 of a bag so he's going to actually buy seven bags okay so he needs he needs seven bags now each bag costs 38 pounds so let's work out the total cost okay the cost before the discount the cost is going to be seven lots of 38 pounds seven lots of 38 again let's get the calculator to do this just so that we don't make any silly mistakes 38 times by seven gives us 266 so 266 pounds and then the last part, it tells us that he gets a discount of 30%. So we need to work out 30% of this and subtract it. Now, I'm actually going to do it slightly quicker. So that the, uh, the final cost, I'm going, to do, I'm going to use a little trick here. The final cost is going to be found. If I reduce the payment by 30%, I only have to pay 70%. So I need 70% of this. So 266 times by you can do 70 over 100 or 0 0.7 you may need to look up a tutorial if you're unsure about how we've done that that's using a percentage as a multiplier so 266 times by 0 0.7 going to give us 186 pounds and 20 pence 100 and 86 pounds and 20 pence.